Hey, what's going on, sexy seven letter squads? Today we're doing a ranked 1v1. I am playing Gilgamesh, playing the powdered toast man skin. I'll be honest. I have no idea what this is. I have no idea who powdered toast man is. But um I haven't played Gilgamesh in a while and I haven't played the powdered toast man skin ever. So I figured, you know, why not combine the two? Get weird with it. I think I'll go first item berserker. Uh Hmm. Yeah. Yeah, I'm just going to go first on a Berserker Shield. It's not great, I think, because of the fact that I don't have power. But... I mean, first item Berserkers is a, is a, it's a good item. It gives you power, gives you attack speed, gives you... Defense it gives you HP five, gives you damage mitt when you get too low. Like it's just a very good item. Not to mention I get a free tier one item at level five, so I'm feeling okay. He doesn't have mannequins, which means he cannot even come close to winning a fight against me. Oh, I am just demolishing him. I'm actually super down to keep fighting. Oh, are you dead here? Nice. Nice. I don't know why he fought that, honestly. I mean, I know he had shell and he had... Um, what was the other thing called? <clears throat> shell and an HP chalice, so he probably thought that he was fine. But I don't know, man. Gilgamesh be smacking. And, and not only do I do a lot of damage, but... The fact that I have mannequins and you don't means your auto attacks are not coming out quick enough. My mannequins did 250 extra damage to you. Like, there's just no way you even compete in that fight. My right, blue buff is down. Red buff is down. My level 5 thing is available. I think I kill you here. Oh, I missed. Never mind. I could have killed him if I wasn't horrible at video games. Pick up this uh, tier one item and get the XP camp. Tier one frostbound with it. All right. Honestly, not bad because that gives me power, right? Yeah, 10 power and 75 HP. That's pretty good. I feel like my jump is so short ranged. Um. Berserker shield is 1100, 1200. I just gotta farm a little bit more. Hello, enemy man. I would try to fight him, but I feel like... Oh, wow. Holy crap. My damage is nuts. Holy crap. I wonder if that's red buff or if, like, even without red buff, I would be hitting that hard. Yeah, four autos for 300 damage at level five. Well, I guess seven now, but geez Louise. I think uh, I hate this. I want to go back and like sell tier one frostbound to finish Berserker Shield. But also, if I can just keep tier one frostbound, it's better. It doesn't feel better at the moment, but it is better. <clears throat> Alright, now I can back. He's probably gonna... Yeah, he's gonna stop my back. I'm gonna run all the way back here. We got Berserker. Gives us a bit more damage. A bit more damage and a lot more survivability. Because I think it went from, what, 15 protection to 40. And then an extra 25% attack speed. I wonder, can I? Oh, you're dead. You can't get out of this. This ult. Jesus. <laughs> Bro. 
Gilgamesh is so good. I don't play him very much at all. I got him diamond within like the first, I think, I think the first like two weeks of him being out. I got him diamond. And then I just never played him again. I don't really know why. Your blue is still up. Only reason I know that is because I didn't see it on him. And I'm just going to keep farming. My next kill that I get will give me another tier 1 item, by the way. So... I wonder if I should try to grab that now. I could just finish the Frostbound. But if I finish the Frostbound now, then he'll just go sprint. Mm, but also I got the tier 1 of it for free, so maybe it's fine. Maybe it's fine. Oh, he just straight up surrendered. Just like that. Well, all right. I guess I'll see you guys in game number two. Welcome back to game number two, boys. Game number one was super quick. Uh, to be fair, he was AMC and he really couldn't run away. And I got super lucky with the, uh, what was it? The level five item pickup, tier one item pickup of going for Frostbound. Which would just demolish the AMC anyways. But uh, it's been a while, actually, between the first game and this game. Because I got prio queued, I think, twice. So, so here we are now. And I'm going to go Berserker Shield into Shell again. I don't know if I want my three this time. Uh... All right, I'll get my three. It just seems like it does too much to not grab. I was reading it here. And you get 10% lifesteal plus 15%. You're, you're the, you get extra lifesteal based on 15% of your highest protection. So 15% of, I guess, physical for me would be what? Like 7% more lifesteal? So I get like 17% lifesteal when I use my three. That's, that's dumb. I never knew I never knew that before. <clears throat> Alright. I do get this though, I'm pretty sure. And now I'm pretty sure you also die. You have no dash. Nah, not dead, but very close. Don't tempt me. I will W key you. I'm going to give up the pressure I have on wave here in order to get the buffs. And the only reason I did that is because he used his, uh, his spit. Oh, you're dead. Oh, nice. I actually caught his dash there. I don't know how I did, because I feel like he definitely should have been able to get past me, but it's fine. I approve this. Good for me. Honestly, kind of rigged for him. I feel a little bit bad that he died there, because I don't think he actually deserved to, but whatever. It's fine. I got to go pick up my level 5 thing right there. All right, let's see what you got for me. Tier one defense. Damn, I am tanky, huh? Don't tell me you think you win this fight. Okay. Do not tell me you think you win this fight, my guy. He almost died. He actually got so dookied on. He is backing. Wow. All right. Discipline. Most people do not do that. Look at that massive wave. Oh my God. 
I gotta rely a lot on my mannequins to help me with this blue buff here. They don't have too much mana. I will pick up the blue buff actually, which allows me to stay in lane. Oh, demon. Dude, I feel like I can just W key people. I, I don't know if I get really lucky by getting a couple of hunter matchups in a row, but jeez Louise. Well, yeah, they just straight up, they can't do anything. I run at them, I kick them into a wall, and then I hit them with my one. The only way they live is barely. <laughs> like that, just straight up, the only way they live is barely. That's crazy. And with my blue buff and my mannequins helping me get a little bit of mana back. That should be good here. And I'm going to give him his blue buff. I can't just stay and be greedy forever. I got to back at some point. And I am going to use that, uh, that tier one breastplate I got. And I'm just going to turn it into a full breastplate. I know that means I have pretty much no power for the beginning of this game. But I also don't think I need it, thankfully. He doesn't have mannequins, so I might be able to seal this. Oh, good dash. Good dash. Alright, we got his dash, we got his alt, and we got his blue buff. It's good stuff. I mean, I'm not too mad that I didn't get the kill. I definitely feel like I should have been able to if I used my kick a little bit earlier. But I can't be mad because it was such a good fight anyways. Like we got so much advantage out of that regardless. And every fight doesn't have to result in a kill. If you win the fight and you get an advantage off of it, then it was a good fight. Dude, you cannot fight me. Please live. Please live. Let's go. I got a kill and it gave me tier one toxic blade. You know what I could do is I could just go six item defense. And I could just go witch blade there. Huh? Yeah, he's Gilgamesh is such a bully, man. He's such a bully. All right, so we'll go Witchblade next, which will give me three defensive items. Witchblade is physical, right? Yes, it is. Um, Once he goes Kanes, I die. But well, I'm hoping that I can stop him from wanting Kanes this early. His dash is down, so I think he dies here. Oh, I did kill him, but I died doing it. I didn't have the attack speed. I could go Toxic Blade. Technically, it doesn't give me power. But it doesn't give me defense either, which means it's not a defensive item. Which means I can't title my video Max Defense Gilgamesh. Also, what I just realized is the more defense I get, the more lifesteal I get. Because of my three. I think the best way to play Gilgamesh, and I haven't been doing this, is... When you alt someone, when you're fighting someone, I think instead of jumping in on them, you alt them and then you jump on them. So you're getting that movement speed. You're getting that uh, lifesteal during that fight in the alt. And I haven't been doing that. I've been using my, my jump just to gain distance, which I feel like is pretty poo-poo. I stay full HP while I'm sitting in that thing. It's crazy. He knows the second I fight. I... Alright, I'm standing in my three, so I'm getting so much life steal. Oh my god. I just took so many tower shots, too. Oh crap. Wait, can I kill here? 
My shell! No! That's okay. He loses an entire wave of XP for that. Which is really, really, really good for me. I'm going to go Thorns, and I might as well upgrade to Breastplate of Vigilance. Reduces damage by 15% from basics whenever I ult. Which, you know, fighting a hunter means pretty much almost all his damage. I don't think trading like this is very smart. Because once he gets Kins and Pen, I lose the game. But... Also, I'm having fun diving, so forget it. Oh, no dash for you, buddy. Dude, I am such a bully. Just walking under tier one. Not tier one. Walking under... Oh, yeah, yeah, tier one. Taking, like, 12 tower shots. Um, what's my next item? Can I get attack speed? And defense. No. Can I get power and defense? Yes. Uh, I guess I'll go void shield. Void shield is like all these items basically. This gives me a little bit of pen. I need to get level 20 so I can upgrade my mannequins, or else I will literally never be able to do bull demon. My damage is horrible. He didn't finish his kins or anything yet. So I'm still pretty comfortable. I just want to make sure that he can't get any buffs, really. Where is he? I don't know where he is. Way back. Let's see. You got Kins. You got Xe. Okay. All right. Xe is definitely a good option. I think Kins would have been better, but Xe is solid. Now he goes Kins, and then I lose the game. So I gotta, I gotta start getting some XP online. I gotta start getting some actual good fights online. Uh, his blue is not up yet. It is coming up soon. Oh, we actually just did bull demon. Holy crap. I can't believe he snuck that that fast. That was impressive. That was very quick. I don't think he gets anything off of it, though. <laughs> What's up, buddy? Hmm. All right. I didn't get the kill there. It was close. We got his alt, so it was pretty much alt for alt. I don't know. Should I go here? Maybe I just go what a delight. these two items, and then I get mannequins. Because this is going to give me what? Twenty-five protection. You are not getting my tower. We got his ult for free again. 
Damn, I actually auto attack. I life steal for 28 damage and auto. While I'm in my three. Which is actually kind of a lot. I really need my mannequins. I think my mannequins is the only thing that's going to give me enough damage to kill him. My one is giving me a lot of damage too, actually, because my one does damage based on how much HP I have. Full Demon's not up yet, right? It, the buff just went away, so I'm sure it's fine. Hello. He has no ult, so I can actually kill him here. Let's go, dude. Huge kill. Uh, actually, it doesn't do anything for me, does it? Because my wave died while I was getting the kill, man. What the heck? Alright. I actually have 114 power now. And almost max defense. Once I upgrade my mannequins, I will have max defense. I'll get my blue later. Right now, I need to get his blue. No siree. Oh my god, my life steal. Wait, what the hell? I was healing for 100 HP and auto. Why was I healing so much just now? Is it because, well, 15% of my... Oh my god, I have 300 protection. 15% is... What is that? That's 45% lifesteal? Plus the fact that it gives me 10% lifesteal? You're telling me that full tank... Full tank Gilgamesh has 55% lifesteal? What the hell? That's insane. I really want to go get my mannequins, but if I back, then he gets bull demon. Oh, he's backing right now. Okay, nice. He backed. Right, now we get mannequins. Now I have 314 protection. 10% is obviously 31. Let's just say 31. An extra half of that is 15. Yeah, 46% life steal. Plus my three by base gives me 10. Dude, that's insane damage. Or, or life steal, I mean. What the actual hell? He did get his kins. I have mannequins now, so this thing will shred. Let's hope he didn't go for blue or red. I mean, he is at red, but okay. I don't care about those minions running the tower. It's fine. All right. So there should be no way that like realistically I lose a fight anymore. Cause I alt and then I jump and I just have infinite life steal. Okay, I turned too quick. Where are you going, buddy? Oh, he beads. Okay. The crazy part is, I think I still win this fight because life steals OP. Look at this. I get like 100 HP in auto. And that is game, baby. That was a good game. That was a very good game. This takes a while, huh? 
Let me life steal a bit here. Can I actually finish the game here? I don't know. I don't know. The upgraded mannequins doesn't really work on Titans, so... I am extremely tanky. I think I can. Oh, I wanted to kill him before I killed the Titan. But I think my kick went through him and hit Titan. I was one auto away from killing him. Damn. Oh, well. That was a very good game. I had a lot of fun. Uh, turns out, full defense Gilgamesh is extremely hard to kill. Not because he's tanky, but because he has so much life steal. <laughs> That's pretty insane. That's pretty insane, dude. Healing over 100 damage in auto with six defensive items. Crazy. Oh, he said GG. I said, I said GG. Then he said GG's. Then I said GG again. Then he said GG's. Yo, how long? How long is he going to go? How long is he going to go? I'm pre-typed. I'm pre-typed. Hit me with it, baby. Pardon my rate. Hey, let's go. I'm pre-typed. Do it again. Do it again. <laughs> this is the content you guys come for. Not the actual game, but the GG spam afterwards. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Until next time, guys. Peace.